again there is a fault in any power system network that time we need to isolate the faulty part of the network as soon as possible depending on the network to do that we need to sense that fault in the network with the help of a relay so this relay will sense that there is a fault there is a disturbance in the power system network and based on the short circuit current and the setting coordination point of view the relay will sense the fault and it will give the command to a circuit breaker to operate and isolate the fault from the electrical network but how this coordination will be done what time it will take to give that command to give that tripping command to any to the upstream circuit breaker that depends on the coordination with the downstream and upstream network basically it will see it will check the downstream network uh, relay coordination as well so it has to check it has to wait from the downstream network coordination point of view if the first relay if the first relay acts like a like the backup protection like the backup backup relay that means the downstream network relay should offer it first and it will be coordinated with respect to time and current to offer it the upstream circuit breaker so definitely there must have some coordination between the upstream and downstream relay to give the tripping command to the respective circuit breakers to do that coordination we need to follow this formula this time grading t time grading t dash equals to twice er plus ect into t by 100 plus tcb plus to plus ts this is the coordination formula between the two idmt relays idmt means inverse definite minimum time inverse definite minimum time so how it will be coordinated let's understand the equation first in this equation er is the relay timing error which is typically 5 to 7 percent or 7.5 percent and next is coming er uh, sorry ect ect is the ct ratio error which is typically 5 percent to 10 percent t is the operating down time of downstream relay what we are talking about tcb is the circuit breaker operating time typically this is 60 millisecond to 100 millisecond it depends on the manufacturer different manufacturers so you need to check the manufacturers relay catalog uh, uh, sorry that circuit breaker uh, catalog you need to check what what is the operating time in case of medium voltage or high voltage this operating time may be different for low voltage circuit that that circuit breaker that operating time may be different to is the relay overshoot time typically this is 10 millisecond to 30 millisecond sometimes it is sometimes it is more than 30 millisecond also in case of static relay nowadays nowadays uh, uh, static and numeric uh, nowadays numerical relays are being used this relay overshoot time this is applicable mainly not for static relays uh, this is mainly for the uh, electromechanical relays where uh, 
uh, in uh, previous days we used this um, this uh, you know that electromechanical relay where this is disk operated so during clearing the uh, fault that time the disk will uh, over travel and uh, even after the fault clearance the disk will over travel and then it will it will come back to its uh, position so that that overshoot time or the over travel time we need to consider during this uh, during this idmt relay coordination in case of numerical relay you can consider this over so really over so time as zero second also but definitely you need to check the oem uh, catalog next is coming the ts which is the safety margin this is typically 30 millisecond to 100 millisecond so if we consider all these parameters all these things here so typically that coordination time between the upstream and downstream relay typically it is coming 160 millisecond to 250 millisecond so this is this is how the two relays upstream and downstream relays are being coordinated so if you have any query uh, let me know already i have prepared a uh, few videos regarding this idmt principle how it is being coordinated in the uh, part of as a part of that uh, protection relay uh, relay setting and protection coordination videos so you can check out those thanks for uh, watching